Time travel. What would you do? Go forwards or backwards? It'd be limitless. I could do either. Maybe forwards. I think I'd choose a flight. Why? The play is about Nancy and Alex, and they meet ten years after the end of their relationship. They're forced together again at a wedding. She is maid of honour. He is best man. They have to come together. They have to talk. That triggers a lot of the memories from this relationship. They sort of realise that they remember things very differently. You have a maddening ability to reframe every situation with you at the centre. That's human nature. No, it's not. It's Alexander all over. Playing the character of Alex, he is an obsessive romantic and he is a man in his 30s that immortalises and glorifies the first love of his life and has not really been able to move on from it. I play Nancy. She's very creative, she's very passionate and she's very feisty. But when we meet her later on, she has had to become a bit harder. I, I love playing that journey for her. I did it for us! Oh, I used to be funner! I used to be funny! And you know you turned me into a doctor of business administration, the literal most boring doctorate in the world! I didn't want that for us! I wanted us to be teenagers! The script does a really good job of translating both mile a minute thought and like complete tongue tied, oh god, I'm panicking. Does my arm go on top or underneath? On top. Even though the script is dealing with some quite heavy stuff, it always manages to find humour. I think I'd be a super villain. No, no, we'd be, we'd be an odd couple team up. You'd be the terror, right? I'd be the moral core, like um, uh, Wolverine and Spider Man. So, a man woman team up? Yeah. Where the woman isn't hypersexualised and looks like she's got boobs for days. We could write one. I think the really exciting thing is this relationship between text and movement. I wanted to look at the interplay between text and movement and whether you could have a two-hander relationship drama that had dance or physical theatre in it. So the movement is very conversational and very much emotional and um, does a really good job of like portraying sometimes how you can't say the things that you want to say but your movements want to like describe. It's intrinsically linked to the emotions of these two characters. Sometimes I think it feels really fluid and really dancey, and other times I think it feels really jarring. Do you really think we can make this work? Is there another choice? Yes. We agreed that wasn't I know. Are you scared? Yes. The show is passionate. It's explosive at times and it really is both heartbreaking and heartwarming. <laughs>